Hey everybody, Fiber Spider back again with Fallout 4. Now, Preston, he had wanted us to check out a place called Grey Garden, which is right here. That is one of our quests. Yes, travel to Grey Garden. So right now, we are at the Jalbert Brothers' disposal. I did fast travel there uh, because it's the closest to Grey Garden. I have no idea what we're in store for, but we're going to go. We're going to find out. Yes, we are. Now, I do know um, that Grey Gardens is a really neat documentary movie about a mother and daughter living in abject squalor with a million cats and so on and so forth. It was a really good movie, actually. Um, there was a dramatization of it with Drew Barrymore. And I want to say Jessica Lang, I think it was. I think that's it. Oh, Mr. Handy. Oh, okay. They they should be fine then if they're just Mr. Handys. Grey Garden. Cool. All right. Well, let's see what's going on down here. There's quite a few Mr. Handies. Looks like we have to talk to that one specifically, though. Okay. Hello? Sup Supervisor White. Okay. Welcome to Grey Garden, darling. <laughs> this is the Commonwealth's first and only hydroponics facility run entirely by robots. She is so elegant. For a robot, I love her. Uh, that's ingenious, actually. You know, it's completely automated. But the irony, though, is that they don't eat food. You know, that that that's kind of the irony. They don't need to eat. So I I still think it's a genius, though. That's pretty ingenious. I bet you can work around the clock. Never seen anything like this. Of course, darling. Our unique hierarchy allows for constant operation. You see, there are two kinds of robots here. The worker drones carry out labor and maintenance. We supervisors, that is myself, green and brown, possess sophisticated cognition processors. We are capable of complex analysis and decision making, a testament to the genius of our creator, Dr. Edward Gray. Hence, Gray Garden, okay. Uh, I'm assuming he died. Um, I would say genius is right, you know, um, in in its way for what it is. Obviously, the man was brilliant to come up with something like this. I could hardly have said it better myself, darling. <laughs> Robotics and artificial intelligence were our creator's great passions, rivaled only by his love of television. Perhaps you've noticed that I possess a rather singular personality, as do the other supervisors. This took a weird turn. <laughs> uh, unique personalities. Why did Dr. Gray give you these unusual personalities? Genius is restless, darling. It abhors stagnation. Too true. Dr. Gray was tired of the standard Mr. Handy personality. He looked to his favorite television characters for inspiration, and we are the result. A few other things you should know. Talk to Green if you need supplies. If okay. If perhaps you require, Brown might have a few odd jobs. Uh, there's one other thing. A question, really. Uh -huh. Tell me, darling, what do you think of the water around here? Well, aside from it being needing to be purified because it's full of radiation um it it's pretty awful it's awful <laughs> isn't it though pressure is down radiation is up why it's practically toxic just think what it must be doing to my skin <laughs> this will never do i don't mean to impose darling but perhaps you could lend us a hand um Sure, yeah. Why not? I'm helping everybody else. Why not you, too? All right. Marvelous. Simply marvelous. <laughs> Most of our water comes from the old Weston plant. 
south of here. Such an eyesore. Be a dear and pay a visit, hmm? See what you can do. Maybe tidy up the place. It must be filthy. <laughs> if you can get it working again, I'm sure I can come up with something for you. That sounds so suggestive. Okay, so now I have to investigate a water treatment plant, among other things. What, what, what's up, Preston? You alright? What is it? When we first met, I admit, I had my doubts about you. But you've done nothing but impress me. Oh. You're just who the Minutemen needed to bring us back from the brink. Thank you. Well, thanks. Thanks? That means a lot coming from you. You've probably realized by now how important the Minutemen are to me. Oh, yeah. When I was a kid, the Minutemen were my heroes. They were the only good guys around, really. When I turned 17, I joined up with Ezra Hollis's company. He was one of the good ones. Really believed in the old-time Minuteman way. We had a few good years there. I felt like I was part of something bigger than me. Like I was really helping make the Commonwealth a better place. Well, we're, we're trying to make a difference, you know? It sounds like you were really making a difference. I think we were. I know we were. But obviously it didn't last. I'm sure there was a lot I didn't see or know enough to pay attention to. You know, the politics and rivalries and bad blood between the different groups. I guess General Becker was able to keep a lid on it keep everyone more or less on the same team. But after he was killed, it all came out in the open. I couldn't believe it at first. These guys were supposed to be Minutemen. They were supposed to put their duty to the people ahead of everything else. You probably think I was pretty naive, huh? I guess I was. Still am, too. Even after everything, I still believe that the Minutemen can be what I always thought they were. The good guys. <laughs> Okay, I, this, okay, his, his idealizing of the Minutemen, it's like, they're, they're like demigods, you know, they're the end-all, be-all, it's what I want to be, it's like, okay, reality is not always panning out like that. I can appreciate his fervor, but I mean, there's a limit. General? Okay, yes, I agree. We are the good guys. We're doing our best, and a lot of it has to do with your example. So I guess what I'm trying to say is... Thanks. You're welcome. Anyway, I appreciate you taking the time to listen. Okay. You're you're welcome. Anytime, Preston. Thanks, man. We probably better get back to it. Yes, we shall. Okay. Yeah, I apparently I I have to keep listening to, you know, the the sporadic ramblings and mushy gushiness every now and then uh in order to have Okay. And they'll be capped for your pocket. Oh, he Go wants... Ahead. He wants mute fruit. Okay. I don't think I have any on hand, though. Supervisor Brown. Caps for mute fruits. That's the way. I mean, there are... There's some growing over there, but... You know, I don't want to just steal them from them yet. Now, I think there's another one. Because that was brown and white. Where's green? Green! Ah. Then let's make a deal! <laughs> Okay. Green. 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 At Grey Garden, the price is always right. <laughs> Shall we make a deal? Okay. Uh, you sound like a game show host. You sound like a game show host. That's the correct answer. Well done. Ladies and gentlemen, should we tell the lucky contestant what fabulous prize he's won? Uh... All right, I'll, 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 I'll play along. Uh, sure. Okay. Right this way, please. Let's take a look at your fabulous prize. Is this guy Monty Hall? Yeah? Supervisor Green. It's a brand new car! <laughs> wow. Now, if you've already got the latest in sleek, stylish, atomic-powered automation, you can also take your winnings in the form of a cash prize. How does 100 cap sound? Well, it sounds good, but... Could I ask for more? I've got an idea. Let's make a deal. Monty oh, Hall. I'm sorry, <gasps> oh, no. you've pushed your luck just a bit too far. I'm afraid 100 caps is all I can offer. 
Here you go. Oh, okay. Well, I kind of messed that up because Preston didn't like that apparently. Sorry. Um, so, uh, what next? Let's see. Do do do. Okay. So, investigate the water treatment plant. Hmm. Yay. And then there's also clearing the way for Green Top Nursery. Talk to the settlers at Green Top Nursery. That is something else we can do. Um, let's check out the Troubled Waters one, though, first. Where is that exactly on the map? It's not that far. Not that far. I just have to turn around a bit. You know what? Let, let's give it a look. Because this actually appears to be the potential for yet another settlement, which would be cool. And then over here, we have the Cambridge Polymer Labs, which is on our map, but we haven't been there yet. Let, let's investigate the water treatment plant. Which I think is that marker down that way. So let, let's head to it, shall we? I am heading in the right direction, yes? Yes, okay. Just making sure. Uh, should I be crossing that bridge? I don't know. I don't think I need to. No, no, we don't need to cross over. It's on the same side. Okay, that that is fine. So, that being said, let, let's uh, look around. Now, since my last episode, I really didn't do much of anything um, consequential. Let's see. I did do a little bit of work on the drive-in settlement. I did. And when I went back to Sanctuary Hills, there was a bunch of raiders that came, and we fought them off no problem. We dealt with them. Just having a bit of a look-see, you never know. You know, they, they weren't really catastrophic to deal with. It wasn't anything major. That That is the thing, though. Like, every now and then, when you're at a settlement, raiders will pop up, and they'll start shooting, and... Oh, hi! How you doing? Oh! Whoa! Hey! For somebody who's- Whoa! Go, oh my god! Whoa! Really? Whoa! 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 Okay, see, I didn't throw the first punch. You did. Oh my gosh. Okay! See, usually red stags are very docile or docile, uh, as long as you don't throw the first punch. Where is he? Alright, we're not really close enough yet. What are you doing all the way out over there? Huh? Oh, what do you got? Whoa! Oh, uh-oh. I see peoples. I see a person. Where'd they go? Super mutant suicider. Okay, that 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 that's not good. And then a mutant hound. Great. And a super mutant. Oh, this is not good. No. You know what? I'm thinking. Um. I'm gonna swap over to my sniper rifle. I think that that might behoove me. Okay, uh, you know what? I'm gonna VAT set up. And, oh, I can do a crit, too. Alright, let's try this. Crit! Yeah! Woo! I got him! That's pretty cool! Unfortunately, uh, I raised the alarm. We got a mutant hound, oh god. Oh, oh! We got a beeper! 
We got a beeper. Oh! He's a suicider. Oh my god. Jeez. Oh, oh, oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, 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 oh. Help me out, Preston. Oh my god. What is with the cavalry? Oh, gee. Oh my god. Run! Oh, run, run. Preston, dude, you are so not helpful. Oh my god. Oh! Oh, okay. I need to swap my weapons. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> wow. Yes, let, let's, let's, uh... <sighs> <laughs> yeah. Whoa! Whoa! Oh! Oh! God! Oh! Oh! Whoa! Jeez! Whoa! Okay, I am taking a serious beating. Oh, stop it! Stop! Stop! Jeez! Yeah, I know. I know. I'm, I'm just trying to... Okay, I need to find some cover. Oh my god. Preston, dude, you are not helping me out here. Oh, 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 reload, reload! Jeez. Ah! <sighs> oh my god. Oh, more of them? No. Preston, seriously, dude. Oh, God. Okay, this is not what I expected. That's not helpful at all, is it? Ah. Ooh, I got him. Oh. Okay, things have quieted down a little bit. crippled here. And one more shot should do it. Yes! Woo! Okay. Now. And I'm fine again. Oh my god. Preston, dude, you were not helpful. Okay. Oh my god. Okay. That was, um... A lot more intense than I thought it would be. A lot more intense. Oh my god. Okay, so, yes, we have a mutant hound. We that, gonna need that, anymore. that That's nice. Um, now, there were, yes, yeah, several of these guys. Yeah, that was a suicider. Oh. He just blew himself up. Yeah, just, I'm taking everything these guys have to offer, 
as compensation for what they did to me. Oh my god. That was... Whew. That was intense. Now, I could have sworn that there were more of them over here. I could totally be mistaken. Okay, now, I can't imagine that that's all of them. I think that would probably be foolish to imagine. Um... Ay, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, <laughs> quick save. Yeah. Alright, so how do I get in there? Go, I go around this way, maybe? Ugh, oh, jeez. Need to find a way in. Also, I know I'm gonna have to give some stuff over to Preston. That That's neither here nor there. I can totally manage that. Um, let's see. Ooh, can I get in this way? Aha! Weston Water Treatment Plant. Cool. Looking for some dry ground, though. There we go. Okay, so far so good. Not detected by anything, that's also a bonus. Ooh, we have ammo, super mutant heavy gauntlets. That's pretty cool, whatever I can do with those. I don't know if I can actually wear them myself, but we are trying. Okay. Mattress. Oh. Not for nothing, but that was a lot more than I had anticipated on, quite frankly. Uh, let's see if I can get in over there. There might be some goodies. It's always worth checking out. Okay, that, that is Preston. I heard some squishy squishy. Ew, what is that? A meat bag. Uh, okay, I, it looks like it's bait or something. I, I don't know. Okay. Just very, very stressful. Not for nothing. Yeah, I am not going in there. Oh, oh, can I search you? Nice. Okay, that's rather convenient. Um, okay, got a bit of a dead end. Oh, you know what? Since you are right here, can I talk to you, please? There we go. Talk, talky, talky. Talk, 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 talk. Happy talk. There we Alive. go. Sure. Here's my supply. Okay, I don't want your stuff. I want to give you my stuff, because I'm so generous. A heavy sniper rifle. What is the one that I have? Oh, I have a hardened. What's the difference? Oh, mine's better. Okay. Then, you know what? Uh, store, store. A powerful pipe rifle. Um, nice, okay, here. Uh, do, do, do. Just take a whole bunch of my stuffs. Um, mm, 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 mm. Violent heavy hunting rifle. Wow. That's cool. Okay. Suspenders and slacks. Yeah, you know, we always need those, right? Okay, the armor that I have is better than that, apparently. Okay. So, store that. Okay. And give him all my junk. Now... Yeah, my, my weight is good. Okay, let, let's keep looking around, shall we? There's a little shack up there. I wonder if I can get around. Let, let's see. Can 
we get there via this way. And yes, because I just stored all those goodies, I'm gonna save. Yeah, we can get there from here, I imagine. Ugh, so gross. A little bit paranoid. Ammo! Nice! What's that? Beer bottles. No, thanks. I'm good. Ooh, hello! A bladed helmet! Hmm. Hang on. Let's see... Super Mutant Bladed Helmet. Not as good as what I have currently. Okay. Okay. Uh... Preston, where are you at? You know, you really shouldn't be down there. Okay, not seeing anything else pilferable, if that's a word. Able to be pilfered? Um, so yeah, let, let's head up this way. Uh, maybe there's something in here? Oh, radio, turn you off. Nothing in the desk. Hmm. I'm, I'm really paranoid. You know, that there might be, like, booby traps or something in here. Fishing rod, huh? Guess I don't... Got your reasons, but that just looks like junk to me. It is junk! You can scrap it, dude! Um, yeah, I'm just really paranoid that there's, like, booby traps or something around here. I mean, I haven't seen any, but that doesn't mean that they aren't there. You know, like this. This, in and of itself, could be a booby trap for all I know. See? See? I rest my case. Yeah, let me hippity-hop over. Okay, can we get in... this way? Because I actually want to get into the treatment plant before I turn 80. Okay, so, all cleared, covered, good. Okay, let's go in. Also, you know what? Not for nothing, but I am quite pleased with myself that I didn't actually die during that. I took a lot of damage during that fight with the super mutants. Oh yeah, I took a lot of damage, but I didn't actually die. So there is something to be said for that. You know, I, I should give myself a little bit of credit. You know, I, I took a lot of damage and I had to heal up repeatedly, but didn't die. Fans I like because they have the gears and things in them. Phones, those are good too. Burnt fashion magazine. Okay. Ooh, terminal. Weston media event and office supply order. Oh, I thought it was going to have to be something I unlocked. Ooh, dirty water. Nice. It is a crafting ingredient after all. Weirdly peaceful in here. Don't say that, Preston. Don't say that. Because as soon as you say, oh, it's weirdly peaceful in here, that's when the stuff hits the fan and all heck breaks loose. And things jump out of the walls and try to kill us. So if you could not say that, that would be great. Ooh, a trilby hat. 
Okay. Cake pan. We got suits, potato crisps, hard hat. We, we got all sorts of goodies in here. And bricks. Lots of bricks. Okay. Um... Okay, we have an upstairs. We have an elevator, which, honestly, I am nebulous about even trying. Let's see what's behind door number one. Yes. Bada bing! Oh, and I've reached level 16! How awesome is that? Very, very, very cool. Oh, and a stim pack. I almost missed that. Wonder glue. A beaker. Cylinder. Cool. Okay. Uh. Now, what is through here? Oh, this is where we came in from. Okay. So, only option would be going up. Gotcha. Okay. Uh yeah. Oh. Okay, going up up to the roof. Okay. Should I be concerned? I hear something. I don't know what it is that I'm hearing, but I don't like it. Almost sounds like... Meyer lurks or something. You know, those giant crabs. You know, those remind me of Gartham from, uh... What is it? Uh, uh, uh... Dark Crystal. Yeah. Ooh, Umbrella! Always need one of those, right? Huh. Especially now. Ooh. I don't think I can unlock Locks it. Looks really strong. No. Oh, but wait, wait, wait. I might be able to. Hang on, hold the phone. I do have a point. Do I want to spend it on safe cracking? That that's pickpocket. Uh where's Locksmith. I can now pick expert locks. Sure. Let's go for it. There have been a number of locks that I couldn't open. Oh, oh. Oh, dang it. At least I know I have to go to the left. Ooh. Sweet. Cool. Uh, not bad. Not bad. I'll take all of it. Okay. That's pretty cool. Okay, so we're on the roof. That That's nice and all, but what is, um... the deal here? Now, we were down there. We're now up here. Hmm. Am I supposed to be going somewhere specific? Sure. Like, was there was there a reason other than that safe to come up here? Pray tell. Get a better viewpoint of the rubble and the carnage that we already dealt with. Just this little office in here. That's it. Interesting. Okay, uh, I guess go back downstairs? I mean... Oh, wait, the elevator! Right, we didn't try that yet, did we? Didn't try that. So, let's give it a whirl. 
I mean, in a post-apocalyptic wasteland, it's not good to uh, use elevators. Whoa, okay. Here we go. Oh, oh! Great. You know what? Um, I think I had a better shotgun, if I'm not mistaken. Let's see. Or did I give it to him? Yeah, violent hunting rifle. Very violent. Okay, so yeah, I've got this hunting rifle, which is 44. And that one is 58. Has more recoil. Okay, you know what? Uh, let's favorite that. Yeah, that's my short hunting rifle. So yeah, let's swap that out. Hold up. Oh, it's got a la laser sight too. Woo! Oh, missed. Yes! Gotcha. Whew. Okay, not bad. Now I, I want to pick the, the parts clean. Okay. Whew. Uh. Whoa. Whoa. Nice. Oh, I can unlock this. This is not a problem. I think. There we go. Nice. Oh. I just came full circle. Well, I still got experience points. That That's worthwhile to me. Black rim glasses. Okay. Might give me more persuasion or something. Okay, you know what? At any rate, listen, I think I'm going to call it an episode here for now. Um, yeah, yeah. Oh, looks like we can go down even further into the bowels of this place. Um, but yeah, I think... Oh, now I'm carrying too much. Preston, where are you at, dude? Where is Preston? I need my little Preston. Otherwise, I can't move. Ugh. Anyway, listen. We're going to call it an episode here for now. Um, yeah. So listen, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you're enjoying it. Uh, we are trying, as stated earlier, we're trying to clean up a water plant so that uh, we can help a farming community of robots. Yeah, the Grey Garden. All right, listen, guys. You have a great day, and I'll see you soon. Bye for now.